welcome back guys to this another video is your boy chaps vans as usual so this is an living channel this is the channel for you where we talk about business and other related issues to finance so i'm back here again with another video so today i'll be discussing with you an amazing topic uh, i just want us to discuss something vital something important so we are going to see the businesses you can do to survive in any city any country Either you are a gentleman or you are a lady. So today it's what I'll be discussing with you guys. So first of all, hit the subscribe button if you are new to this channel. And also don't forget to like this video. So let's jump straight into the video. First of all, I'm going to talk about two important businesses you can try to do. Uh, whatever country you are in. So I'll be relating the examples to the country Uganda where I come from. So first of all, uh, if you need to survive, either you are a lady or a man, these are the things you have to consider. First, you have to go out for Uber, Uber driving. So if you have that driving skill, if you have the permit, uh, because if you want to join Uber, you need to be having a driving permit. Uh, these are among the requirements. So you must be having a driving permit and uh, you need to be having an interpol uh, that one is like a police certificate yes so you also must be having a national id that one is the uganda national identity that the national id uh, we call it endanga Muntu here so you also must be having a car so here the challenge comes in getting a car so you'll be like where can i get a car if i don't have money uh, if I don't have a car and I don't have money to buy it. So you have to consider. So this is what you'll do. So you have to find someone because there are some people who have cars and they are not using them like on a daily basis. You can go ahead and rent out that car. Then another thing you can go out to bonds. These people who sell cars. So there are some bonds which can give you a car. Even if you have 3M or 2M, then you'll be paying on a monthly basis or on a weekly basis. So you will be using this uh, Uber uh, to make money so that you can pay the car and you also remain with some amount of money. So uh, some people rent out cars at 200, uh, that's 200k per week. Yes, you can make that money. Uh, then if you go for a loan, you can, uh, if you have your 6M, 5M, or even 2M, uh, they'll give you like, uh, you'll make like an agreement, uh, maybe for four years, then you can be paying per week, maybe 250, things like that, so that at least you can be working. Yes. So if you have that skill of driving, please go and look out for bonds. Those guys are offering cars because they have cars which stay there for even more than years without people buying them. So when they get you, you want to drive a car, uh, you want to take it on a loan, things like that, they'll be able to give it to you. So I recommend this one to do it yourself. Uh, don't get that car and give it to someone. Yes, don't get that car and give it to someone to drive it for you. So if you have the driving skill, do it for yourself because it will be better rather than giving it to someone else to go and do it for you. So I'll go through the requirements. So if you need to start up, go for that Uber. Yes, you'll go and register their offices. If you got these requirements, uh, you have to be having a driving permit. Then you have to be having an Interpol, then national ID. Then also another thing, uh, uh, these guys, if you take their the car to register with them, they'll do some checks uh, to make sure the car is in good condition because this one will be uh, driving passengers. So that means the car which is going to drive passengers, it has to be in a good state. It must be having a third party, uh, the service you are doing service, it has to be in good condition. Yes, so they'll do some uh, checks then you'll be passed out to go and start making that money in that way so if you are good at driving if you have that driving skill you have your permit seated home there no you can go without uh, you can go with this you go with uber go and check them out wherever you are this one is worldwide then go and register with them you'll be able to make some good cash so another business i will talk about call it a business 
this is the safe border safe border is here in uganda i don't know other countries yes eh wali wo kan wali we no business ya safe border eh osobolo genda no registering a safe border yes bo bibeta ga bitono sibinji olu sibeta ga ko registration ya mitwalo etano so uh, get 50k uh, that's ugandan shilling go and register with safe border their requirements are not a lot they only need the registration fee that is 50000 uh, if you have a border border or if you have a motorcycle yes this one is good for you you go and add it there register with safe border they will give you two helmets they will give you reflector jackets then after the registration they will also give you a smartphone then install that application then start making money so this one will help you to make more money extra money so that at least you can improve the state of your living conditions things like that so for safe border those are the things uh for them it doesn't need a lot of uh, requirements so if you have a motorcycle and another thing even if you don't have a motorcycle they have people they partner with so they can give you even a motorcycle after giving you a motorcycle then you can be paying uh, in the meantime so uh, if you have like one m still they can arrange and give you a motorcycle then you'll be paying maybe on uh, a monthly basis or weekly basis depending on what is easier for you so that's the safe border thing yeah so that's the safe border thing yes so more brief if you've been bad day in jagalo sharing and i'm way to get the cuckoo uba business uh huh bobo sobola bobo manio kufuke motoka uh you've been to have young also local actually again no registering abanaba uba beta gisa you know kubeda ne driving permit beta ga interpo then we know kubeda ne ndanga montu uh, we know kuba ne motoka bobato ine motoka osobolo funo muntu wali wa abantu banji ba ine motoka osobolo tuka ko ku bond eh then no buza manyi mm? no buza ne bakutegeza buli chimuche betagisa then basobola no kuwe motoka ne bakuola ku loan then no sasula ku chibanja mpola paka boji mazeyo then no sobolo kuweweza ko E, then netuwa gira kuku safe border e, Osobolo genda no registering Na haba safe border Bote beta gabi njio Bo ina pichi yoba toina e, Osobolo batu kako no registering Registration ya mituwa retano Then e, Neba kuwa helmets bidi Neba kuwa reflector jackets Then neba kuwa ne border Baina beba pata ringa Na bo neba kuwa border No tandi kukufugo Osobolo jisa sula na yoku chibanja mpola Bo vera ne yo Then chivera fine nyo So Biebimu bie mbade njagala kushare nga kona mwele ilo mweno video e, Kansubire muina che muize mu e, Nsubira muina che muize mu mu video Bobo jisanze ya, Ngeri oke okay, then Etewe la bila kusubscribe nga Like nga video eno jishare nga Na wano na boba sobole ukukolachi Ukuganula mu mchino Ya yeah, I hope I hope I hope uh, you've benefited from the video I'll just leave you for now See you in the next video Peace. Bye.